In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to quickly shade your backgrounds in Flash. So I've got a really simple setup here. I've got my background movie clip, and then on top of it, I've got this light source, which is made up of a gradient. And I've made a tutorial about how to make these light source gradients, so if you want to check that out, just click on the annotation on the video. Okay, so I'm going to be focusing on my actual background movie clip, so I'm just going to double click it. And then what I want to do is just make a new layer, I'm just going to make a large object which encompasses my background, so I'm just going to make a big red rectangle. And it doesn't matter what color it is because it's going to be changed very soon. So I'm going to have my rectangle selected, and then next I'm going to go over to color and select linear gradient. So you'll get the default gradient which is going from black to white, and so what I want to do is just change the black to white, so it's going from white to white, and then change this white's alpha to zero. So what you'll find is this really cool effect where it starts off really bright and white and then just slowly changes into transparency. So it essentially creates this really cool shading effect. But at the moment it's on the wrong side, it's going from left to right rather than top to bottom. So I'm just gonna go over to the gradient transform tool here, have it selected, push this in here, rotate it 90 degrees like this, and then push it back out. So what we get here is we get this really nice shading effect, but at the moment it's quite strong, so I'm just gonna select it, go to convert to symbol, and then I'm just gonna go to properties, and I'm just gonna adjust the alpha so it's a bit more subtle. So I'm gonna go for about 60, I reckon. All right, cool, so let's go back onto the main stage. So as you can see, it creates this really nice shading effect with the actual light source coming in, getting really bright and then gradually dissipating like this. So before I end this video, I'm going to be showing you a slightly different shading effect. So I'm just going to go back onto my background and then I'm just going to go back onto my movie clip which has my gradient in. So all I'm going to do is have my gradient selected. I'm going to go back to color and I'm just going to change both these values to black. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go back to the gradient transform tool and just rotate it 180 degrees. And if I go back onto the main stage, you essentially get a very similar effect. It just adds more shading. So it's basically the inverse of the brightening shading effect. So it goes from normal color down to dark rather than really bright down to normal color. Okay, so those were two really easy ways of shading your backgrounds in Flash, and it's a really cool way of adding a bit more depth to your backgrounds. Alright, so as always, I hope you found this tutorial useful, and if you want to see more videos like this in the future, please subscribe.